Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Will's Treasures. We got a very, very special day for you today. So stick around throughout the whole video. You're not going to want to miss one step of this whole process. So we're out at the smoker here. I got my Rectech grill. We're going to be smoking something amazing today. It's very early. I got my coffee. It's six o'clock in the morning here in the Poconos. Got to get this done early. And last night, I didn't film it, but I got myself a nice brisket. And I rubbed it down with the Blues Hog Bold and Beefy Brisket Rub. This is some great stuff. If you've never tried it, check it out. You'll find it on the internet. But we're out at the old smoker. And I'll give you a little walk around here. This is a electric smoker. Runs off 110. You got your dual hopper in the back. So you don't have to worry about running out of any pellets throughout your smoking process. It holds up to, I believe, 20 pounds of pellets. Got your little smokestack there, your drip bucket. Here's the inside. So we're gonna fire her up. Got the old 235 right there. You have the temp display, and if you're running at a low temp like this, anything below 250, you can put it on extreme smoke. And what that does is it slows the fan down inside the, uh, the smoker here. So the smoke stays in there longer, and you get a much better smoky taste. You only want to do that on certain meats, though. So it's warming up. I'm going to close the hood. We'll get it up to temp. And then I'll bring out the brisket that has been in the fridge overnight. Letting all those, letting the rub work in there, letting the salt start to break down the fat and the muscle. Uh, it's going to be a good video, so I want you to stick around and check it out. Okay, now that we have the grill up to temp, we got a 235, brought the brisket out, waiting until you take a look at this. Now I did trim some of the fat off of that and you'll see why later because that's gonna get incorporated into the cook. Get a little sip of coffee before we get started here. Oh yeah. All right. There we go. So this is gonna be a total of 10 hours of cook time. We're gonna come back and check on it periodically. Make sure that's uh, getting that nice bark that we want. So stick around and then I'll show you what we're gonna do with that fat that I trimmed off. Cause that's a pretty cool trick. You're gonna to wanna to stick around towards the end to see what I do to this lovely piece of meat to finish it off so you have the perfect brisket. 
All right, so we're at the two hour mark. We're gonna take a look. Oh yeah, look at that. Get some nice color, just the way we like it. Beautiful. I'm gonna give a little, little spritz. Now what I use there is a little bit of water and apple cider vinegar. Keep that on there. Got a nice steady temp. So yeah, spray it down, keep it moist. Plenty of pellets left. Good deal. I'm gonna leave it in there for another couple hours and take a look at it again and see where we're at. All right, back out at the grill. And this is the fat that I trimmed off of the brisket. There's quite a bit of it. And we're just going to, oh, look at that. I'm just going to put this on the grill there. Oh, that's looking pretty. We're gonna let that fat render down and we'll use it later. All right, we're at six hours now. Let's take a peek. Oh, looking beautiful. Beautiful bark forming, wonderful color. The fat's starting to render down, you can see it. Yep. Definitely making progress. We got another four hours to go. Don't leave now because upcoming, we're gonna take it out, we're gonna wrap it. It's where the magic happens, so stay tuned. All right, back out at the grill. It's time to take a internal temperature. She is looking just fine. Let's see what we got here. 178. We're looking good. All right. We got the right temperature now. We're going to take it inside and wrap it. All right, we got the brisket inside here. We're gonna get ready to wrap it, but first we're gonna take the rendered down fat. I'm gonna brush some of that on there. Don't be afraid to go heavy on it. There you go. Secret sauce right there. Let's take her back outside, toss her on the grill.
Now she's gonna sit on there for another two hours and we'll be ready to go. All right, we got the brisket inside. We're gonna unwrap it. Looking good. We're gonna try a little bit off the tip here. Look at that. Mm. Let's show you the inside here. Oh yeah. That's some smoky goodness right there. You got the smoke ring going around it. Super juicy. Boy, that just came out beautiful. Get a little piece here. Hmm. Perfect. All right, we're going to slice this up. Let it sit for a little bit. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Let's keep this train rolling. This is Will from Will's Treasures. And I'll catch you guys on the next video.